There you go, here's a steam engine you've never seen before, I guarantee it. It's a steam engine made out of a spark plug. And, yeah, does it run? Well, of course it runs. I build it, it'll run, don't you worry. KLG spark plug. And put the air in here and the piston goes in and out. And the wheel goes round. Let's try it and see. So how does it do it, eh? <laughs> how does it do it with no visible means of uh, support, air-wise? Air goes in here, piston goes back and forth here, the wheel goes around. What's on the bottom? Nothing. So I think you've pr probably figured this out already anyway, most people. This is a bit of a fun project. That's interesting. Still going to run it in a bit. You can see the exhaust pulsing the uh, bit of paper. So it's exhausting out the end of the crankshaft. Same as the other David Kurzel design. How cool is that, guys? I mean, <laughs> pretty much guarantee you've never seen that before. Well, not with a spark plug, anyway. People have done a hidden gallery like that before, but I don't think so many people have ever used a spark plug as the motive source of power. So here's the trickery. Underneath is a line. The airline goes from the rotary valve, crankshaft, block, across, into the bottom of the riser, up the riser, into the spark plug and then into the brass cylinder. And that's it, everything's hidden, so you'd never know. And on this side you can see the the outlet for the rotary valve. It's bas basically based on the David Kurzel design and uh, just a bit of trickery to hide everything so you wouldn't know that it's feeding from here to here. And the base is routed out to take the pipe. So, yeah, but it's on here, you won't see any of it. Pretty cool, eh? <laughs> Right, it's a bit quieter now. I had it on a board before and it was vibrating. So, uh, yeah, it's pretty smooth. Not bad. So, yeah, that's quieted down a bit. Quite a lot. Crank up a bit.
Well, here it is with twin flywheels. I put that flywheel on to see how it goes. Doesn't seem to make much difference really because it runs pretty smooth as it is. Slow it down. I think it might go a bit slower with two. Yep. Uh, oh, she's going to go, eh? Yeah, it probably does look better with two, I think. A bit neater. Well, there you go. What do you reckon? Two flywheels or one? Yeah, I think the second flywheel adds a bit of character. Yeah, I'll leave it there. Running in a lot better now. Yeah, that extra flywheel did help out. Plus, it's run into. Yeah, working out pretty good. I'll show you the air it's using now with the second flywheel on. It's been a bit of a run. Yeah, this is really running good now. Amazing. Bit of a run, bed things in. And Look at that. Oh, oh, awesome. KLG Power G20. Okay, that's it from me, and it just shows what you can do with a bit of junk and a bit of spare time and a cheap little metal lathe and a bit of imagination. So get out there in that workshop and get that lathe cranked up and get it moving. Okay, that's it for me. I'll, I'll see you next time. Cheers.